one of the important things I wanted to show, and you've seen this before in demos, that an existing rendering is going to look like this. It's like the static PDF. It doesn't really show you much. And that's because this is really a snapshot of a Revit file. One of the key outputs that's generated by the software is a Revit model. And what I've done here, I've uploaded to the Autodesk viewer a couple of um, sample Revit files that were generated by Design Generator. Um, just so we can take a quick look and see. So this is a site that was marked. There's some existing assets here and some new ones. If we look in the model browser, we can actually see the level of detail that's in this model. So there's both generic models and specialty equipment in here. Um, and this is an opportunity, if you're an equipment supplier, we work with lots of them to incorporate their specific equipment into the software. As I zoom into the Revit model here, you can start to get a sense of the level of detail. And this is used to generate many of the output documents. For example, there's a civil bill of quantity. This is giving you information about the concrete, the site prep works, the wall plaster, the ceiling plaster, and so on. These things are all coming from the civil design that's done in the cloud and then turned into this Revit model. The other one that I loaded is a plant in West Chicago. It's another good example. Again, you can see there's a bunch of drawings, both existing and compound site plans here. And if you have Revit on your machine, you're able to open this, add additional detail. Here in this one, you can see that there's this big area here, that's a no build zone. So this is an area where there's, um, not possible to build in this particular design, but you can see all the clarifiers and um, this plant happens to have anaerobic digestion. So you can see that as well. And in the model browser, we can go through and, you know, there's a lot of detail in here that uh, will be helpful as you kind of move forward with your civil design. 